This morning, police are investigating what they call a suspicious death. A mother and her young son died after falling from Petco Park's concourse level onto the sidewalk below. News 8's Chris Grow live outside Petco Park now with the latest on the investigation and including reaction to this. Just so sad, Chris. An extremely sad event. Now they have identified the 40 year old and that two year old. However, those names have not been released at this time, so we still don't know uh, again who died in this incident, this mother and young child. But at the same time, police looking into a lot of things right now, trying to answer a lot of other questions, including whether or not this was intentional or accidental. This 40 year old mom and her two year old son, they died after falling from the stadium concourse level. On to, onto the sidewalk below us right here. We're on Tony Gwynn Drive and Allen. For a lot of people familiar with Petco Park, with Padres game day, this is an area that does tend to get pretty busy. So again, this happening at a time when there were a lot of people in this area. So no doubt police are going to be talking with those who may have been inside Petco Park, but also outside trying to determine exactly what happened before these two fell. Again, trying to figure out exactly what may have happened here. We are speaking to the father of the child. They were not married, um, but we do have the, the father of the child here, and we are speaking with him. And the Padres did release a statement yesterday saying that they were deeply saddened by what happened. If you want to read the entire statement and more on this story, just go to our website, CBS8.com, and click on that story link. Eric and Stella.